Welcome back. Well, many events, events have had to cancel because of the COVID situation, including, unfortunately, charity events, which obviously is not good since they're out there trying to help people that need some support in our community. One of our favorites here on the show, she didn't just sit by. They had to cancel their main event, but they're still out there trying to make a difference. So I'm, of course, talking now about our good friend Sue Barron with the Golden Drive for Homeless Kids. Sue, welcome to the show. It's great to see you. Hey, Chris. Thanks for having me. Thanks a lot. So you guys had a big event plan, had to cancel it, but knowing you, you still said, okay, well, I'm still going to go out and make a difference. So what are you guys up to? Oh, that's for sure. Yes. Uh, we had to cancel our big event at uh, Bonanza Bill. That's our big event, our community event uh, we have every year. That was canceled. So with this pandemic, we we really needed to do something. So we have created the Golden Drives Community Relief Event, and that is running now until uh, July 16th. And uh, it, it, it's a food and product drive. So uh, basically any, any baby supplies, any hygiene items, and non-perishable food items. And 100% of what is raised will go right back into our community for our homeless kids to help them. That's incredible. So kind of walk, walk us through that. So I mean, if I bring you out a bunch of food or things that you need, how do you end up di distributing it or dispersing it? Yes, on the, uh, the 17th, uh, when this ends, what we'll do is, you know, we're gonna organize all the product that we have, and then we'll be dispersing. We'll be dis dispersing from Frazier to YouthWorks, to Churches United, to individuals, to, uh, just to make an impact because as we know, this pandemic has made a bad situation much worse. And and uh, we have, you know, a lot of people that are homeless, they reach out to these shelters. They reach out, that's where they get their, you know, resources, their supplies, uh, whatever they can, whatever we can do to make a difference. It doesn't take much, Chris. I mean, basically everything you're looking at here is a dollar, a simple dollar. And we know a lot of people went out of their way and they bought a lot of canned goods and whatnot when this pandemic started. And um, as, as you know, it's it, it, like a can here, you know, just a, a simple can of soup, cup, cup. If you want to just open your pantry, you know, just see what you have. You can drop it off right here at the West Fargo Fire Department. It doesn't take much at all to make a difference in a child's life. And once again, there's just everything, you know, from cough drops to soap to shampoos to baby wipes. We have, you know, jellies, honey. Ramen's always great for the simple fact that you just add water, but any of your grab and go items would be great. I mean, we've got, you know, star peanuts, one dollar. That's what this that's what a lot of this is. But anything that you can do, it will it'll make a huge difference because we know poverty is a gateway to homelessness and we've seen the impact that our, our uh, food banks and our food pantries, they're they're getting annihilated right now with the, the needs of people where people are either lose, lost their jobs if not they're losing hours i mean there is this pandemic and it, it it's not over yet so we are really trying to make a difference for these children we really are chris we know you are talk a little bit about the need you've mentioned here touched on it a couple of times but it's always i think hard for people to fathom that there's homeless kids so how how severe is the problem here in our community yeah, we have we have several we have several homeless children and You'll never really have an accurate count on homelessness for the simple fact that you have a lot of uh, couch hopping. You know, people stay somewhere for a while. They'll stay somewhere else. Uh, your teenagers, teenagers are overlooked a lot. They're considered the invisible just for the fact that they are older. But they they need they need just like the next kid. You know, children, they're really there's the only difference from a house child to a homeless child is just that a roof over your head, a house, you know, a home. Uh, these children, when you wake up in the day, think when you wake up throughout the day, what what do you need? You need to eat, you need to drink. You, everything that we need, the people that are housed, that's exactly what a child needs. You know, it without food, they, they don't learn as much. They get sick more often. There is so many rippling effects to homelessness outside of the, the obvious, you know. And we have shelters. Boy, do we have resources in Fargo-Moorhead. We have great shelters doing great things, helping these children, helping families. We have outreach programs. Um, if It's so simple. Don't think you need money to make a difference, especially in a child's life. Really, what you, what you need, your time, if you, your time, your talent, whatever you can think of, reach out, call, call a homeless shelter. Reach out to the Golden Drive. We have an event Facebook 
uh, page started for this. We we have our Golden Drive Homeless Kids Facebook. Uh, you can reach out, call uh, the food pantry, call uh, one of our local shelters because everything the Golden Drive does stays right here to help the kids right here in our community. And without this great community and the great supporters that we have, we wouldn't be here right now doing what we're doing. So we're we're very sad that we had to cancel our big event, Chris. That is yeah. our... Well, you guys do such right. great work. And so, Sue, thank you. we got to leave it there, but we've been putting up the... Uh, the graphic there to show people, hey, you can go to West Fargo Fire Department, drop stuff off, and uh, help make a difference. You can see the time and the dates there. And, Sue, keep up the great work. We appreciate your time. Thank you very much, Chris. Thank you. Have a golden day. Thank, Thank you. you. You too. I love that. All right, stay with us. we got much more coming up right after this.